It's supposed to start raining at 3 a.m. and rain all day tomorrow. I got these onions out here. I just got the lettuce plant and some other stuff, so that'll be fine. But I really want to get these onions in the ground because they're just kind of sitting here. So I've got this mound here. I've just mounded up some dirt. <clears throat> I wanted to till that a little bit better, but I think it's going to have to do. So I'm just going to make a straight uh, row down the middle, and we're going to throw these onions in real quick. So I got my garlic growing over here, so I'm kind of trying to keep, you know, all my all my plants in that family sorted together. Okay, got us a little burrow now. <clears throat> These are the plants from last year, and they've just started to get the green tops on. So we're gonna pop all of those in. Space them out. Oh, roughly. It was about eight inches there. <clears throat> so I don't know how these are gonna do. This is the first time I've ever, you know, used this these like starts from another onion. So it's just kind of new. Just something to experiment with and just kind of see how it works. <clears throat> Very interested to kind of kind of see how this is going to turn out And one row is going to be about enough. To cover them up, leave a little green show in here. Elena, you know, we got a bird in here. Yeah, you're probably right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. That would be correct. Is there any eggs? No, no eggs yet. But they have been working pretty hard at this. It's impressive. Yeah, they've put a lot of stuff in there. Time to go out, take a stroll. We have the last remaining turkeys here. Of course we got uh, 12 to begin with. We're down to three. Everything seems to be dying around here. Can you hand me a thing to prop this up with? Because they're out of water and food. I knew we were going to get rain, but this storm hit pretty abruptly. It didn't say anything about storming weather, hail, and high winds. But we were out of town. Now it's coming back in. I didn't quite beat it. So, of course, sheep got a little wet. 
we got him in the barn now i fluffed up some straw for him and put a little hay in here so they have something to eat while training have a nice warm dry spot they did get wet but carried them back in and as long as they stay in here now they'll be dry at least they know they're dry now they know where this spot is so they can huddle together and stay warm my three remaining turkeys the three out of 12 that remain got the heat lamp on them i'm trying not to take any chances on them but they're doing okay got new feet in there got new water they're staying dry i'd like to see them actually live got the chickens up got the dogs inside and i wanted to get some more planted before we got these rains but so i just have to wait until the the garden's dried out but it's it's tilled up and it's ready to get planted got the potatoes coming through here poking through the dirt got kale coming up more potatoes got my lettuce planted got a little bit of uh more kale beets carrots more beets and then over here we got some cilantro strawberries are doing good so everything's getting watered rabbits got plenty of food and water i grabbed them some uh fresh dandelions and clover when it stops raining and get them all fed so and get through this little storm here